Hi kids, today we're going to learn about fractions, but before we go, I have to go grab my backpack. Why don't you grab a snack from the fridge? How many equal parts there are That number goes below the bar It's the denominator How many equal parts there are It's the denominator goes below the bar Count the ones you need Then stop and write that number up on top And that's the Count numerator Count the ones you need Then stop yeah, that's the and numerator. write that number up on top Count how many equal parts there are I see you've met my fraction friends in the fridge. What they were singing about is very true. Why don't we go to the classroom so we can learn more about fractions? Oh, there you are. Let's review what my fraction friends sang to us in the fridge. Um, count how many equal parts there are and place that number below the bar. That number is also called the denominator. Next, you count the ones you need them Stop. Place that number on the top. That number is also called the numerator. Let's say I was really, really hungry and I ordered a large eight slice piece of pizza. Um, and, but my eyes were bigger than my mouth and I was only able to eat three slices. So our first step is to count how many equal parts there are. There are eight equal parts of this pizza. So that is our denominator. So our eight number goes below the bar. Three was the slices of pizza that I ate, so that's how many pieces I counted out. That number goes above the bar, and that is our numerator. So I ate three eighths of my pizza. Here are some more examples of fractions. Three fourths. One third, eight tenths. Fractions are everywhere. 